You want to clip part of your stream within a push of a button? Well, here's a fast way to do it in OBS Studio. So what you want to do is go down to settings, over to output, you want to click on replay buffer, enable replay buffer. I have mine set to 40 seconds. Go over to re recording and you want to set a recording path. So if you want to set it on your desktop, just make a folder, name it replay buffer or clips or whatever you want to name it. And then link it to this recording path. You want to go down to apply. And then we need to make a hotkey. So scroll down, find hotkeys, and then scroll all the way down until you see replay buffer. You want to set a hotkey. Mine is just control. And then whatever that button's called, I'm not even sure. But you just want to um, add some hotkeys, click apply and you are all set so whenever you're on a game or whatever you get like a nice snipe or whatever game you play you have a funny moment and you want to make a clip just click on those two buttons the hotkey buttons and the file video file saves right to your uh replay buffer folder let me interrupt you real quick i was editing this video and i forgot one little detail to mention if you go into obs um once you have your replay buffer uh, enabled this button will pop up down here it will uh, say stop replay buffer or start replay buffer you want to always make sure you start the replay buffer but you can automatically start this when you open OBS if you go to settings uh, go to general where's this at uh, yeah output so automatically uh, where's it at Automatically start replay buffer when streaming or keep replay buffer active when stream stops. Um, I don't have them selected. I don't need it. It's just a habit at this point to always turn it on. But uh, I thought I'd let you guys know about that. Um, yeah, let's get back into it. And if you have a Elgato stream deck, this is a fun little thing to do is you want to. Um, Go over to multi-action, which is under stream deck. You want to open multi-action and then go down to system, add a hotkey, click and drag it over to the multi-action. There's a hotkey and then you want to assign the hotkeys. So mine was control, you want to click and hold control and then that button. And then another little feature is I downloaded Twitch Tools Bar Raider Clip to Chat. So you want to clip and or click and drag it over here. Uh, you want to log into your Twitch down in this info area down here. And every time you click on the replay buffer button on your stream deck, which will be this one right here, it will automatically clip the 40 seconds into the folder and clip a video link to your chat while you're streaming so your viewers can click on the, the link to watch the clip. It is a super cool feature. I use it every time I stream. And uh, hopefully this helps whoever's out looking for an uh, easy way to get clips to edit. So thanks for watching and hopefully this helps you guys.